May it please the court, opposing counsel, members of the jury. Imagine a construction site, and on that site is a large crane. In fact, the largest crane on the East Coast. Now there's rain and wind just pounding on it. And then you see a woman standing next to it. She's the site supervisor, and she, I mean, the site inspector. And she's waving a red flag, signaling to stop the lift. Then a man runs out. He's a site manager. He grabs the, the flag from her and starts to wave a green one, signaling to go ahead, and he leaves. As the crane starts to lift, a large gust of wind comes, knocking it over. And under the mangled metal are the bodies of two people. One is the woman, who was the site inspector, and the other is an innocent pedestrian. And where is the man that signaled to go ahead? He's nowhere to be seen. He's off in his office, unaware of anything. My name is Caitlin McVeigh, and I'm the representative for the Commonwealth of Pennsylvania. And today we will prove to you beyond a reasonable doubt that Tatum's Elias is guilty of third degree murder with malice. We will prove that Tatum's Elias constantly ignored safety regulations in the interest of making money. That he had a fin financial interest in the project and that he ignored the weather reports and the advice of the advice of his experts. On the day of the lift, that's not where I wanted to go. Our witnesses are Emerson Turkin, the site supervisor, and he will tell you that he was not in control of the site and that Tatum's Elias was. Our other witnesses are Quinn Baxter, who was the OCIS investigator responsible. And she will tell you that he constantly ignored safety regulations. And our last witness is London Packard. And he is a man who saw firsthand that of the, um, the dangers of the site. We also have three exhibits that will all tell you how unsafe the site was and how Tatum's Elias constantly ignored safety. We will prove to you beyond a reasonable doubt that Tatum's Elias is guilty of third degree murder with malice. You have, you have a commitment to your nation to choose the right thing here. And the right thing is to find Tatum's Elias guilty. Thank you.